All right. Hey, yogis. This is Autumn from Mbusha Yoga. And it is bright and early in the morning here in North Carolina. The sun is just starting to rise. Um, but today I really wanted to share with you what's called a yoga nidra practice. You can think of it as a guided deep relaxation practice. And the idea for this practice for yoga nidra in general is to let the body rest while the mind remains awake. And we work through what are called the panchamaya koshas. So we begin with the physical body, right? this meat suit that we walk around in and experience the world in. And then we work into the pranamaya kosha, which is your energy body, right? So your breath, your vibrancy, your life force. And then we work into the mental body, the wisdom body. And then finally, we land in Anandamaya Kosha, which is the bliss body. It's this place that is beyond all conditioning. It's this place that is um, blissful, right? Joyful, easeful, spacious. So it's in this space that we are able to access the subconscious mind and begin to actually create new, healthier thought patterns, new, healthier habits that are aligned with our truth, with our path, with our gifts. It's a really beautiful practice on a deeply restorative level. It's also a really beautiful practice on a deeply transformational level. So very cool. I'm, I love sharing this practice. I share it at every single retreat, something that is often requested that I get begged to teach at um, the yoga studios I teach at. So I'm sharing it here with you. This practice will be a little bit longer than a typical Mindful Monday. Typically, these Mindful Mondays are like 10 to 20 minutes. This one will be probably about 30 minutes or so. And when I facilitate, I also have you, the student, um, create what's called a sankalpa or a resolve, an I am statement or intention. And it's something that is positive. It's a positive I am statement and it's something that is true at your core. So even if it's something that you're wanting to cultivate in your life, right? You're on this path of transformation. There's You're wanting to cultivate more. You know, there's something more for you. I want you to know that that is already true within you, right? The desire is already there. It's already happening. You just need to open up to it, right? And to put it into place. So our yoga nidra practice gives us that opportunity again, to drop into the subconscious mind, to create those new thought patterns, create those new samskaras as what we call them in yoga, these grooves in the mind, right? No, even on neuroscience level, we know that what fires together, wires together. So same concept. So go ahead and begin to gather up your props. So remember, you'll want to um, kind of create a nice cozy little cocoon for yourself. So you can lie in bed if you feel like you'll stay awake. If you're like, oh, I probably won't stay awake. Um, if I lay in bed, put yourself on the floor. Yoga Nidra is typically practiced lying down, um, but you could also practice it seated if for some reason you can't lay down right now, like you have a cold or something. Totally fine. And I encourage you to maybe grab like a bolster if you have one available or a couple of pillows, place them underneath your knees. That's a great way to release your lower back. You can also um, put a pillow under your head. That's also really lovely. You can make it nice and cozy. And then add a layer over your body. Even if this may be kind of warm where you are, the body temperature actually does tend to drop during yoga nidra. The blood pressure drops, the body temperature drops. So you actually get a little bit cool. You might even find that you get a chill or a little like subtle uh, vibration when you're practicing. All right, so go ahead, pause the video and get your supplies and then we'll meet up right back here. And then I am actually going to hop off camera and put on the screen, um, the creek from the back to nature retreats this year um, one of the students shared that she was that she had recorded the creek the year before and just how beautiful it was and it is it's a, an incredible creek a very magical creek and um so i was like hey you know what i'm gonna record it i'm gonna record it this year so i created a recording of the creek so i'm actually gonna pop that up onto the screen so you have a nice soothing um, imagery on your screen. If you do happen to open your eyes during yoga nidra 
And also you get to enjoy the beautiful sound of the creek in the background instead of maybe hearing the traffic in the background here. <laughs> so I will hop off screen and um, pop that creek up and we'll get started. Again, just to reiterate, Yoga Nidra or yogic sleep is a deep relaxation practice that guides you through the Panchamaya Koshas or the layers of your being. It begins with the physical body, moves through the energy body, into the mental body, the wisdom body, and finally lands in that Ananda Maya Kosha or bliss body. It gives us access to our subconscious mind where we can create new beliefs and thought patterns that support us in becoming the best version of ourselves. And it also gives us an opportunity to land in that bliss body and be beyond all conditioning. We work with what is called a sankalpa, and you can think of it as an intention or a resolve. It's that positive I am statement, and it is something that is already true at your core and your essence. And it may also be something you are wanting to cultivate in your life, and this is your reminder that. If it's something that you're wanting to cultivate, it's already within you. It's already true. So it's perfectly valid. And you will form that statement as if it's already true, right? So here are some examples. I am confident and capable. I am worthy of love and happiness. I am peaceful and calm. I am strong and resilient. I am aligned with my highest truth. I am open to new opportunities and experiences. I am filled with gratitude and joy. I am a beacon of light and love. I am connected to the wisdom within me. I am living my purpose with clarity and passion. I am guided by love. I am empowered and strong. I am divine. I am the witness. I am love. Take another moment to form your sankalpa. Close down your eyes and take a few deep breaths. Breathing in through your nose and exhale, sighing it out through your mouth. Two more. Breathe in. Exhale, let go. One more. Allow yourself to fully arrive in this moment. There is nowhere else you need to be, nothing else you need to do. As you settle in, I would like you to bring into your mind's eye your sankalpa. Commit to your one sankalpa and repeat it quietly and internally to yourself. Now bring your awareness to your physical body. Feel the support beneath you and let your body sink into the earth beneath you. Guide your awareness to your breath. Witness your natural breath without trying to change it. With each exhale, let go of any tension or stress and allow your body to become more relaxed. Envision any stress or tension melting down into the earth beneath you, no longer yours. Bring awareness to your feet. Feel your feet relax and release. Now move your awareness up to your calves your thighs, your hips, and lower back, letting each area relax completely. Continue this journey up your body, up your spine, 
to your shoulders, your arms and hands, releasing all tension as you move upward. Finally, relax your neck, face and scalp. Feel a wave of relaxation wash over your entire body. Bring to mind your sankalpa, your I am statement. Remember, it's a short affirmative statement that resonates with your heart's deepest desire and your higher self. It is true at your core, at your essence. Repeat this intention silently to yourself three times with conviction and feeling. The practice of yoga nidra begins now. Move your awareness to your mouth. Become aware of your tongue, lower jaw, lower row of teeth, upper row of teeth, gums, upper lip, lower lip, space between your lips, both cheeks, right ear, left ear, forehead, both temples, top of the head, back of the head, tip of the nose, right nostril, left nostril, right eyelid, left eyelid, right eye, left eye, right eyebrow, left eyebrow, space between the eyebrows. Now go to the right hand, the right hand thumb, second finger, third finger, fourth finger, little finger, palm of the hand, back of the hand, wrist, forearm, elbow, upper arm, shoulder, right armpit, ribs, waist, hip, right thigh, knee, calf, ankle, heel, sole of the foot, top of the foot, right big toe, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, little toe. Go to the left hand, the left hand thumb, second finger, third finger, fourth finger, little finger, palm of the hand, back of the hand, wrist, forearm, elbow, upper arm, shoulder, left armpit, ribs, waist, hip, left thigh, knee, calf, ankle, heel, sole of the foot, top of the foot, left big toe, second toe, third toe, fourth toe, little toe, groin, right buttock, left buttock, lower back, 
mid back, upper back, right shoulder blade, left shoulder blade, back of the neck, back of the head, right inner ear, left inner ear, roof of the mouth, throat, right collarbone, left collarbone, right chest, left chest, middle chest, upper abdomen, navel, lower abdomen, groin, whole spine, the whole head, right arm, left arm, both arms together, the whole right leg, the whole left leg, both legs together, whole front body, whole back body. Be aware of the whole body. Now bring your awareness to your breath. Feel the natural rise and fall of your abdomen. Imagine you are in a serene forest. With each breath you take, you are inhaling the fresh, pure air of the forest. Visualize the breath flowing up and down your spine like a gentle stream. Each breath cleansing and renewing your body and mind. Now begin to count your inhales and exhales. Counting down from 54 to one. Inhale, 54. Exhale, 53. Inhale, 52. Exhale, 51. Inhale, 50. Exhale, 49. Continue on your own. If you lose count, begin again. Now bring your awareness to your left leg. 
Feel the sensation of heaviness fill the left leg. The left leg becomes very heavy. Go to the right leg. Feel the sensation of heaviness fill the right leg. The right leg becoming very heavy. The right arm. The right arm filling with heaviness. The left arm filling with heaviness. Now continue to fill the whole body with heaviness. The whole body is so heavy, it is sinking into the floor beneath you. Experience this feeling of heaviness in the whole body. Feel the whole body filling with lightness at one time. The feeling of lightness completely filling the entire body. The spaces between the body and the floor increase as the body becomes weightless. The body begins to hover just above the surface of the floor. Surrender into the feeling of weightlessness. Be fully aware of the weightless body. We now move to the experience of pain. Recollect the experience of pain any kind of pain you have experienced in your life. Remember that pain. Feel that pain. Make that experience of pain as clear as possible. Deepen your awareness and feel it intensely. Now experience the feeling of pleasure, any kind of pleasure. Try to relive a vivid experience of pleasure. Concentrate and remember this feeling of pleasure. Deepen your awareness and experience the feeling of pleasure fully. Release the vision of pleasure and remember not to sleep. Remain aware of my words until we finish Yoga Nidra. Imagine yourself standing at the entrance of a beautiful sacred forest. This is a place of safety and wonder. Feel the warmth of the sun on your skin. Hear the rustle of leaves and smell the fresh, earthy scent of the forest. Feel the soft earth beneath your feet and see the dappled sunlight filtering through the leaves of the trees. Notice a path unfolding before you, leading deeper into the forest. Curious, you walk toward the path. Ahead, you see a tall ancient tree with deep roots, a strong steady trunk and widespread branches. As you walk along the path, notice the sounds of birds singing. 
and the gentle rustle of leaves in the breeze. Notice a gentle deer and her fawns grazing peacefully nearby. Feel a deep sense of peace and a connection with the natural world around you. Towering trees shade the path ahead. Verdant ferns and gnarled roots align your path. A stream in the distance entices you to continue forward. You feel safe and at ease as you continue down the path. As you walk, you notice a small object on the path. Bending down, you see that it is a beautiful stone. You pick it up and turn it over in your hands. You see your sankalpa etched into it. As you hold the stone in your hand, feel the energy of your intention radiating from it. Allow this discovery to deepen your connection to your sankalpa. The path continues ahead and leads you to the base of a tall mountain. As you begin to climb, feel the strength in your legs and the steady rhythm of your breath and your heartbeat. With each step, you feel more grounded and connected to the earth beneath you. As you reach the summit, take a moment to admire the breathtaking view. Feel a deep sense of accomplishment and clarity. And you sit in awe. You notice an eagle soaring overhead. And that the sun is beginning to set. You turn and begin your descent down the mountain. You reach the clear waters of the stream. You sit by the stream and dip your hands into the cool, refreshing water, allowing the water to pour over and through your fingertips. Feel the flow of the water, carrying away any remaining tension or stress. You stand up and follow the stream's course until it reaches a serene and tranquil lake. Its surface calm and reflective. Your mind is as calm as the surface of the lake. Allow yourself to be fully present in this moment, feeling the harmony and balance of nature. Release the image and bring your intention or sankalpa back to mind. Visualize the stone with your sankalpa etched onto it. Once again, notice the radiant energy flowing from your sankalpa. Now repeat your intention silently to yourself three times with conviction and feeling. Trust that this intention is being planted deep within you.
Begin to bring your awareness back to your physical body. Feel the support beneath you and notice any sounds in the environment around you. Wiggle your fingers and toes, gently stretching and reawakening your body. The practice of yoga nidra is now complete. When you are ready, slowly open your eyes, taking a moment to orient yourself before getting up. Take a moment now to appreciate the journey you have just taken. Carry the peace, clarity, in connection with nature, along with the energy of your Sankalpa with you as you continue into your day, your week. Thank you for joining me for Yoga Nidra. I hope you enjoyed this practice. If you would like to explore additional Yoga Nidras, don't hesitate to reach out and I will add you to the Yoga Nidra email list. I hope you have a beautiful day or evening. Namaste.